Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I really quickly wanted to share with you a Sam's Club haul today. I went today for the first time in about at least a year, maybe over a year, and I picked up some cool things that I wanted to share with you really quick before I put it all away. Did you go with me? Say no, you went to school today. Okay guys, let's get into the haul. Okay guys, so the first thing I picked up is this pack of ground beef. This is 8812 ground beef and it was $3.98 a pound. So I paid $18.55 because it's over four and a half pounds. This is a super good deal. Lately at the grocery store, I usually try to buy 8515 ground beef, so it's pretty lean, and it has been six dollars a pound. It's outrageous. Thank you, inflation, but this is a really good deal, and all I'm gonna do is section this out into like one or one and a half pound sections and bag it up and put it in the freezer and we can just use it as needed so that is a super good deal and really good to buy in bulk i also picked up some feminine products i will put the prices here on the screen of everything i got a pack of tampons and then these panty liners you know as a woman things that you have to have and it never hurts to buy them in bulk because I don't anticipate not needing them anytime soon so I always like to keep those in stock. A couple snacks so for Daniel and I which Grant will probably eat these too but we love these Nature's Bakery Fig Bars. This comes with 16 blueberry and 16 raspberry. These are so good. I used to buy these at Sam's all the time when I went more regularly. And since I hadn't been in a long time, I decided to pick those up. It's a super good deal. I picked this up for Grant um, with school in mind. So he goes to a parent stay out program two days a week and he does have to take a little snack for snack each day just for himself and it's really easy to just grab a prepackaged bag of something so I don't have to pack it up separately um, so we'll see how he does with these I know he'll eat the Teddy Grahams and probably the cookies I don't think he's ever had these crackers before so that'll be interesting but I think I honestly think he'll like all of those so that was a good deal Another thing I always buy at Sam's is these Cascade dishwasher pods. It comes with 105. These last me a long, long time. Probably maybe over half a year. I'm not really sure because it's been a while since I've had them, but I really like using these. Something new I picked up this time are these women's multivitamin, um, the gummies. I've never had this brand before, but I recently bought like the Kroger store brand of gummy vitamins and I've been liking them so much. So I decided to go ahead and pick up this big pack of those. Um, I also picked up these two books for Grant. We are always, always, always reading. And so we get tired of reading the same books over and over. And as you can see, he is very, very much into <laughs> construction vehicles. So I'm thinking I may put one or both of these back for Christmas. Honestly, it's already almost the middle of October. So we may keep one out for now and one for Christmas, but we'll see. These were a pretty good price. I could probably have gotten them cheaper on Amazon, but sometimes it's nice to just buy things in person. Okay, you guys, I'm down here in our... Um, basement the laundry room bathroom area um, but this is where we store a lot of the bulk items in this little cubby that's under our stairwell so it needs a door on it but you know bear with me this is the rest of what I picked up at Sam's um, I did get this 24 pack of LaCroix it is a really decent price at Sam's um, I think almost nine dollars for this but lately I've been buying the Kroger brand of seltzer waters and it's like over four dollars for a 12 pack so if I can get LaCroix for almost the same price as the store brand I'm gonna do it and I just love having these for lunches or like an afternoon pick-me-up every day I also got this two pack of the olive oil non-stick cooking spray this is such a better deal as compared to what i can get at the grocery store so i always love picking these up and if you if you've ever bought olive oil spray you know that sometimes the spray nozzles on them are just awful but these the members mark brands they work just fine so if you're <laughs> wondering about that these work good hi Ollie. hi 
Hi. Um, speaking of Ollie, I did get a huge pack of cat litter. Um, this lasts us quite a long time and it's a pretty good price. I think you can get maybe a comparable price at uh, Walmart, but since I was Sam at Sam's, I went ahead and got it because we always need that as well. And then I also got him this pack of cat food. So he primarily eats dry food, but I've been giving him one can of food twice a week as like more of a treat and it has helped him so much. His fur looks better. He um, is having less like stomach issues, I think, if you know what I mean. He has no mats in his fur and he's gaining a little weight, which is really good because I think when we brought Grant home from the hospital a couple of years ago, it like threw Ollie for a loop. So poor little cat, he's been stressed, but he's, he's healthy and he's fine. So I got this big pack. It was a, a better price than it is buying it at the grocery store for our 48 cans. So picked that up and he does really well with these flavors. One of the seafood flavors like makes him throw up TMI. So I didn't get that one. I got the turkey, chicken, beef, and ugh, liver. Gross. <laughs> Anyways, the last thing I got is this three pack of ketchup. Uh, if you are a parent of a toddler or a little kid, I know you can relate. We use ketchup at least once a day, every day. Grant is always dipping stuff in ketchup. So it's just good to stock up on it and have it on hand. So I'll put the prices up here. I spent total about $221, which I uh, almost died at the register, but I'm excited to see like how it affects my grocery bill over the next few weeks. I know it's not like an immediate return, but over time it is cheaper to buy things in bulk and to have it on hand. Okay guys, I hope you enjoyed this quick little Sam's haul. And if you shop at Sam's, let me know in the comments below and what are some of your favorite items that you like to buy in bulk. I'm a little bit new to this. I know that as Grant continues to grow up and if we do have another kid in the future, just buying more food in bulk is gonna be the way to go, obviously. And especially, he already eats so much, so. <laughs> I know I'm going to be buying certain things in bulk in the future, but be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. If you want to see more hauls on my channel, leave it in the comments below. Leave your video requests. I would be happy to make videos that you guys enjoy watching. Subscribe if you're new here. Join me for cleaning motivation, home decor, and mom life videos here at Kindly Katie. I will see you guys with my next video. Bye!